The reason why I think this is an excellent bonnet or excellent dryer for deep conditioning, I cannot stand hot air blowing on my face. So that's the reason why I don't have a hooded dryer. I had two hooded dryers and it was like torture sitting there for 20 minutes, 30 minutes, an hour, two hours waiting for your hair to dry. It drove me nuts. And I ordered it at Target.com. I think I paid $31 for it. Also saw it on eBay or Amazon for $89. Okay, do not pay $89 for this bonnet. Although it does perform very well, I would not pay $89 for it, okay? Heat is direct and it is continuous. The heat is very, very consistent. I wish the hose was a little longer because when I'm deep conditioning, I'm doing several things at once. I'm on the phone, I'm walking around, I'm cooking, and I'm actually holding a container with me walking around. So I kind of wish the hose was a little longer, but of course it's not designed for that. It's actually designed for you to sit still during the deep conditioning process. So that's just my little problem. So it has two settings, the medium setting. Well, it says cool setting, but it's actually medium. It doesn't get cool at all. And it has a hot setting. I wish the cap was a little bit bigger. I don't use it for roller sets. It does not fit under the cap. That's a disadvantage to using a bonnet, but that's why I use it more for deep conditioning rather than styling. The bonnet is a little small in my opinion. That's a, that's a con that I have. You have to sit still because if you're moving around and doing different things while you're deep conditioning, you can rip the hose, you can detach the hose from the body of the dryer, which is exactly what I did. I did that for the second time. Maybe it's poorly made, I don't know. I think if I had sat still on those several occasions and not been doing all, you know, multitasking, I don't think it would have ripped. But it did rip in the same exact spot it did before. Now I've had this dryer now for four years. So, you know, $31, four years, I think that's kind of fair. I mean, I obviously like the dryer because I purchased another one. It does not have a cool setting. The bonnet itself is kind of small. I wish the bonnet was a little bit bigger. But those, those are my only two cons, but other than that, I love it for deep conditioning. I love it because there's no air blowing on my face. I love it because you can deep condition it quickly because the airflow is direct, it's continuous, it's hot, and it's evenly distributed. So those are my reasons why I love this bonnet for deep conditioning. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section and I will address them when I can. <laughs> All right, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.